is host to opposing teams in five of its eight games to open the month of December. On the 16th, the reigning MVP and new sidekick four-time All-Star Paul George enters Madison Square Garden featuring a team that figures the challenge for the Western Conference crown. OKC shipped out Victor Oladipo to Montes Sabonis to Indiana for George. The two teams will kickstart the 2017-18 season opener on October 19th. The number eight overall pick, Frank Nielakina, makes his regular season debut. Tim Hardaway Jr. is back for the orange and blue as the Knicks hit the road, a 1,300-mile trek for the season opener in OKC. We'll also see Knicks newcomers Michael Beasley and Ramon Sessions on the floor for NYK. Chris Stapps for Zingis enters this matchup against the Seas after averaging 16.7 points per game in last year's meetings. The new look Knicks face a Celtic squad that captured the regular season Eastern Conference crown a season ago and added NBA champion and all-star Kyrie Irving in a trade that sent Isaiah Thomas to Cleveland. The Green also acquired perennial all-star Gordon Hayward. Two top 10 rookies, Frank Nielakina for NYK and Jason Tatum will be featured in this Atlantic Division battle. Before the two teams tangle in late December, they will meet in Beantown on October 24th and conclude the series back in Boston on January 31st. stage will be set for opening night at the world's most famous arena on October 21st. The Saturday night matchup places the spotlight on Frank Nielakina's debut. Chris Tapp's Porzingis is back for his third season and Tim Hardaway Jr. returns to the team that drafted him in 2013. For the Pistons, Reggie Jackson is expected to be ready for the opener after suffering from injuries last season. The Pistons also bolstered their backcourt this summer by acquiring defensive ace Avery Bradley drafting Duke shooting guard Luke Kennard and signing former Knicks point guard Langston Galloway. After the opening night at MSG, New York heads to Motown on December 22nd and completes the season series on March 31st. The month of November is filled with home games and one of the marquee matchups will provide some intrigue for the MSG fans on November 13th. The defending Eastern Conference champs await as this specific matchup will mark one of four meetings between the two teams. Of course, the loaded Cavs are led by four-time MVP LeBron James. This offseason, Cleveland shook up the roster by shipping Kyrie Irving to Boston in exchange for Isaiah Thomas and Jay Crowder as the main principals in a larger trade package. The Cavs also inked former Knicks point guard Derek Rose and Jose Calderon. Melo, Kristaps Porzingis, and company will look to knock off the Beast in the East on the 13th and back at home on April 9th in NYC. The meetings in Cleveland are set for October 29th and April 11th. A November 1st Wednesday night special at the Garden will be packed with superstar talent on the floor. Houston sent shockwaves around the league by trading for nine-time All-Star Chris Paul. Paul has aged down to join last year's MVP candidate James Harden in the backcourt. The Rockets also acquired P.J. Tucker to build depth along their front line. 24 days after the first matchup at MSG, the Knicks will complete a back-to-back -back in H-Town on November 25th. Two young teams are set for a head-to-head -head battle on December 12th at the Mecca. The Knicks' number eight overall pick, point guard Frank Nielakina, and the Lakers' number two overall pick, point guard Lonzo Ball, are expected to square off in front of the MSG crowd. The Lake Show were busy this summer by drafting Ball, signing Contavious Caldwell-Pope, and dishing D'Angelo Russell to Brooklyn in exchange for Brooke Lopez. The second and final meeting between these two teams will take place in La La Land on January 21st, as part of a seven-game road trip. Chris Stapps forcing his head to head against Joel Embiid, Frank Nielakina versus Markel Fultz. The new look Knicks versus this up-and-coming Sixers squad should provide high entertainment value on the NBA's biggest stage on Christmas Day. At noon, both teams hit the floor as part of the marquee slate of games on December 25th. Philly will look to welcome back Ben Simmons. They inked sharpshooter J.J. Redick and signed Amir Johnson. Both teams split last year's season series and the margin of victory was only 1.5 points per game. After the Christmas showdown, New York travels to Philly on February 12th and the final matchup is set for March 28th 
on the Sixers' home floor. The spotlight will shine brightly on the two big men, Chris Stapps, Morzingas, and Carl Anthony Towns when the Knicks and Wolves go toe-to-toe -to -toe on March 23rd at Madison Square Garden. The draft mates engaged in two battles last year with Porzingis' squad earning the upper hand. KP averaged 20 points and nearly seven boards against the Wolves in 2016-17. Minnesota was one of the busiest teams in the NBA this summer by trading for Jimmy Butler, signing Jeff Teague, dealing Ricky Rubio, acquiring Taj Gibson, and drafting Justin Patton. The first meeting this year takes place on January 12th in Minneapolis. To conclude the month of February, the defending champs enter hostile territory on the 26th as Golden State makes its lone trip to the Mecca. The Warriors roster is littered with all-stars we saw last year. Steph Curry, Klay Thompson, Kevin Durant, and Draymond Green. Golden State also added Nick Young, Omri Caspi, and drafted Jordan Bell. The Knicks will head to Oakland on January 23rd in the midst of a seven-game road trip. The Knicks' second home game will take place against their crosstown foe, the Brooklyn Nets, on October 27th. Last season, New York took the first two games between the two teams, and Chris Stapps for Zingas averaged 19.7 points, 10 boards, and three blocks per game in the four meetings. Over the summer, BK traded for D'Angelo Russell and Timothy Mozgov in a deal that sent Brooke Lopez to the Lakers. The Nets also acquired Allen Crabb from Portland and drafted Jared Allen. On December 14th and January 15th, the Knicks faced the Nets on their home floor before the January 13th contest at Madison Square Garden to conclude the season series.